Hi guys, I'm Courtney, and I'm going to be talking to y'all about Chapter 6, Orthopedics. I'm going to try to make this as interesting as I can and make up a little story of life in a hospital. While working in the hospital, you see a multitude of problems every day. I will give an example of an average day of working in a hospital. As I got to work and was getting a report on my patients, this is what I was going to be taking care of for the day. Stanley, seven years old and was admitted into the hospital with a green stick fracture. A, fract a green stick fracture is an incomplete break where one side of the bone breaks and the other side only bends. To fix his arm, they will do a fixation, which is a procedure to stabilize the fractured bone while it heals. There are several types of fixations. External fixation, which is casts, splints, or pins inserted through the skin. Internal fixation, pins, plates, rods, screws, and wires that are put into place during a surgical procedure called an open reduction. Next is Helen, 67 years old and came in with chronic pain. She is scheduled to have a DXA, which is a dual energy absorptiometry, done in a half hour. A DXA is a test using low dose x-ray beams to measure the bone density to diagnose osteoporosis. John has osteoarthritis and is due for his next dose of non-steroid, non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drugs or NSAIDs, which is a large group of drugs that provide mild pain relief and anti-inflammatory benefits for conditions such as arthritis. His osteoarthritis is arthritis caused by the loss of cartilage cushion covering bones and joints. Most common in bearing weight joints, results in bone rubbing against bone. In the other room, Mary's results came in from a radiography, diagnostic imaging procedure using x-rays to see an internal structure of a body, especially useful for visualizing bones and joints. She has a stress fracture in her left foot and a spiral fracture in her right foot. A stress fracture is different from a spiral fracture because a stress fracture is a slight bone break caused by repetitive low impact forces such as running, rather than single forceful impacts. And a spiral fracture is a bone break in which a fracture line spirals around the shaft of the bone, caused by twisting injury, often slower to heal than any other types of fractures. I hope this helped y'all a little bit in understanding different words with orthopedics. Thanks.